Blake Harrison, Joe Thomas, Simon Bird, and of course, James Buckley. It is an absolute pleasure. Right. How are you guys doing? Stars of the Inbetweeners 2 movie. We're, we're doing pretty, pretty well. very well, yeah. Pretty well. Um, I've got to say, I don't know if I like the film. Because okay. oh, okay. I haven't seen it. No there one's seen it. Say. No one's seen it. Say. It's been under lock and key. It's the way we always do it. We did it it's for the first film as well. Because we were talking about the first film. <laughs> <laughs> and also we were like, okay, fair enough. Also, <laughs> well, can you round it up for us a little bit? Sum it up in one word each. Oh, okay. It can be an adjective, it can be a noun. Okay. Um, wow, yeah. Um, rude. Whooshed. Yep, that's rude. good. Flies, uh, penises. <laughs> vomit. Yeah. <laughs> that, yeah. Penises and vomit. Yeah. That gives yeah. a sort yeah, of that's a all you need slightly. To know. <laughs> yeah. I, I heard that on set, uh, if something is funny, you can get away with mm -hmm. it. Yeah, that's well, it. I mean, what, what does that entail in the outback? In the Aussie outback? Um, <laughs> what did we do? <laughs> um, maybe on the outback we were kind of on better. Behavior. Well, we well had... no, the outback. There's oh, no, something we were, strange yeah. happened in the outback in that because it's so deserted, we sort of felt a little bit liberated. Yeah, we felt a bit uninhibited. Yeah, there's a, there was a lot of sort of <laughs> nakedness going on. Naked. There was some nakedness. There was some yeah. wee breaks. We, we, we wee breaks. To, yeah, we can't go into it. Well, it's it's weird. To, yeah. In a way, there is something quite liberating about, you know, having I mean, a... I mean, they had a, a kind of port thing there, but when you're in that yeah. kind of wildness, you want to be a bit of a, a beast, and you just go into the... You walk, what, you walk off 50 yards yeah. and just, just... And then have a little wee-wee. Nice. Yeah. Talking of beasts, uh, One Direction were recently in Australia, and it was feared that two of them came back with chlamydia from a koala. Oh, from a koala. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's true, it's oh, true. Oh, that sexy sure. koala. Oh, yeah, <laughs> you, can, you can get chlamydia from a koala, yeah, if it pees on you. Did yeah. you have any run-ins with creatures, Australian bush creatures? Well, we, we were hoping to koalas. See. You uh, held a koala, didn't you? I did hold a koala. It did not wee on me, so I think I'm chlamydia-free. Oh, hopefully. It has got quite severe herpes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's separate. I heard that you might have run over a kangaroo. Some, that, well, no, yeah, that us. did happen. Oh. That was... Yeah. Oh. Oh. It was an accident. No, it was... <laughs> no, it was a, what it was, was it was a... There was a mate of mine that um, turned up in the outback to come and have a drink with me. Yeah. He travelled all the way from England. Literally for a pint, as yeah, far as... Yeah, for a I pint. Mean, and um, on his journey in, he, he did hit... He did hit a kangaroo, the guy that was driving it. Yeah. Yeah. They, yeah. yeah, so we've we've slightly reduced the wildlife of Australia. Yeah. They're rodents, though, aren't they? It's really sad. Yeah, she had a little um, baby kangaroo in her oh, couch. Oh, she had a well. joey! <laughs> what, yeah. yeah. what sexual transmitted disease can you get from a kangaroo? Well, from running over a kangaroo? Yeah. <laughs> I think it's um, syphilis. Well, I wonder if, like, the Australian <laughs> sort of ST, STD adverts, you know, when they're like... It's you might like, think running over a like kangaroo is <laughs> just the laugh a minute, but be careful. You know, like, you you know, like in this country, there was that advert where like a woman was wearing like a necklace, and it was like, God, yeah. yeah. Oh, that's it. Yeah. Is that it'd be like a sort of sexy? It'd be on the rhubarb, wouldn't it? <laughs> wearing a pair of pants, it just says, uh, <laughs> "I'm here." <laughs> Rule fish, yes or no? If I had one meal left on Earth, it would be sushi. So, raw fish, yes. Raw fish, yes. Okay. Like raw good. fish, yes. I like sushi. Wow. But is there anything that you would not put in your mouth? Uh, okay. <laughs> There's lots of um, things, really, isn't there? Um, well, top of the list. Oh, top of the list. Oh, what about a little testicle? Probably no, not. top of the list. Top. Oh, sorry. Okay, um, so obviously it's, that's it's not what you wanted. Sorry, yeah. 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 Oh, and this one's um, testicle. Use that. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> like a sort of curve. Yeah. Well, on the like a mouse's of... testicle. <laughs> a vulnerable. <volleyball. laughs> <laughs> um, probably. Probably. Yeah. I, mean, I mean, classic. Is either like sick or poo, isn't it? Not sick or poo. No one wants. But poo here's something they that. wouldn't eat: these two philistines. You wouldn't eat a cricket. No, we even though it was served in a proper true. restaurant. You wouldn't eat a cricket. We yeah. went, to, we went, we went to, to an amazing restaurant in Australia. It was amazing. Amazing. It was amazing. It was amazing. It was amazing. It was amazing. It smelled like wet dogs. It's so so overrated. These guys it was, loved it because it was really poncy. It was so poncy. Poncy. Yeah. Like they they it only gave you homemade Coca Cola. 
Like, you, mm. like you asked for a you Coke. You know what's in actual Coca-Cola? Yeah, bad that's, things. So that's that's yeah, but it tastes so I good. Know. And if oh, I want something so that tastes potential. good, give it to me. Exactly. What's the card? Oh, those I know, chirpy those little things. You know, the evening you can get No, they're huge. They're massive, those things. Yeah, no, I wouldn't. No, I don't want to eat a bug. That's a, don't, don't. But don't, no, but that, was, that wasn't why me and Blake didn't like it, because we weren't up for eating bugs. But it was like, it was a Chinese restaurant that did sort of these little bug meals as well. So we just thought, we'll order some normal Chinese stuff. It was awful. Mm -hmm. It was just a bad restaurant. It was a yeah. bit different to how you get it from like your local no, Chinese no, takeaway. Can, and can, because of that, no, it was... We don't necessarily need to get into this now. Well, I think we do need to get into it I think we do. Because his attitude stinks. Well, the, the restaurant stunk, mate. I, know, I mean, yeah. his attitude well, smells much better than the restaurant. Because your attitude was inside it. 